you report that one way that Cottonetti characterizes this hundred years is this tension between um, a populist impulse on the American right and what he thinks is the better impulse on the American right. How, how does that come out in the book? Populism relates to some of the issues I mentioned earlier, uh, focusing on America itself as opposed to integration of a world system with a grand uh, kind of philosophical or ideological project, in particular, a project that I think many of us would call neoliberalism, but it also has many parallels with neoconservatism. Continenti sees the Republican Party of the 1920s as being quite populist. Basically what happens is that uh, after the Great Depression, the Republican Party loses its electoral mojo. And at the same time, Continenti uh, portrays a uh, picture of conservative intellectuals as also being out of touch with the American public. 